And we're back at Tolstar's area. Uh, let's hit a save point here. And uh, we'll take on the boss. Like a soul. Yeah, let's see here. Now you have 130 coins. It took you long enough, but well done. I'll take those coins now. Finally, just let me out of here. Huh? You want out? You want me to help you? Who said I do that? What? You, Welcher! <laughs> what? No, no, no. You're not in the Mushroom Kingdom anymore. Outsiders, be gone! All right, second boss time. We have Tolstar. He's basically a spike. A really, really big spike enemy. He will throw spikes out at you. Depending on which arm he throws at you, he will uh, throw it to whatever brother he feels he sees fit. Let's get here. Now, I want to do the splash bows as many times as I can, because I'm hoping to get the advanced move before getting off the next area. I hope. If not, then I'm not going to lose too much sleep on it, though. <laughs> Is that a nasty attack? Even watching the hand I throw won't help you. So he's going to try to throw try to throw ourselves off by uh, not revealing which way he's going to hit us with, but it's still his call is still, is still the same. Alright, see ya! Booyah! Now Mario's out of power, and so like Luigi's going to have to use his all by himself. Huzzah! And I don't have enough serves to restore Mario's power yet, so I can't do anything about it. Oh, pff, why did I jump for? Alright, because Tolstar's going to be throwing his mines up and uh, be bouncing. So if they're bouncing, don't jump. There we go. Mario, let's use an item, just to be safe. Might as well be safe than another. <laughs> Take that! You missed! <laughs> he missed! <laughs> I'll take you all. Jump on your head. Let's go take you down. Hmm, not bad. Not bad at all. But how about this? Nah! Nah! He's, he's moving out of turn! Oh, that's breaking the rules! <laughs> and I have read the rules. <laughs> you go, and then I go. See? That's how it goes. Nah! <laughs> take this! Nah! <laughs> take that! You missed again! Ho ho ho! Now I jump on your head! Oh yeah! Boy, you now! It is! Nee! Nee! You are really having a hard time hitting me now. No matter. I'm gonna take you down regardless. Whoa! You missed again! Ho ho! I jump on your head again! Ho ho ho! Huzzah! Come on, man! I mean, we're not doing very much damage, but still, it's an early game, so we're not going to be doing very much. Not until we get into the... Oh, there we go! Boss is defeated! 30 points! And that's usually a level up. Usually bosses are usually give you a level up regardless, so... It's not completely guaranteed, but it's usually there. Mario needs the power, and I get one again! What is my luck? <laughs> And uh, Mario levels up, and Luigi is leveled up to level 5. No brother points for him, but uh, I don't get too worried about that, though. Two points for, Mar for Luigi. Oh, yes, I'm number two, aren't I? Uh, lips! You, sir, have been grappling far too loudly for some time, huh? Huh? Eh? Take this! Uh, Mario, a uh, green stash. You gotta get Princess Peach's voice back. It's all up to you. Uh. Should we go? Yeah, maybe we should go. Now off. All right. So now we've got our first boss battle down. We're gonna be hitting a save block a little bit later here, so no one's worried about going back to the back ones. Right there. Oh yeah. Again, Tolstar was not bad. Not bad of a boss, but, you know, it gets the job done. Boss fights are going to get more interesting from here on out, so be wary of that. 
We're gonna have to go through some caves now. And having a happy, ho ho, good time. Let's jump up this way here. Spin to win, as usual. Mushrooms. I wish it was syrups, though. Please, that'd be awesome. I have enough mushrooms. I want syrups, because I would love to, you know, restore my bro points at some point. You fiends! Ah! No, I didn't break the law. We we found you at last, you scum! What have you done with Prince Peasley? Yes, there was no mistake. You kidnapped Princess Peasley. No, 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 I didn't do nothing. We have witnesses now confess villains! No, we're Mario and Luigi! Yeah, I'm Luigi. Was that you say you're the Mario and Luigi? Lies! Ball face lies! The superstars of the mushroom here would never come here! <laughs> they're not lying! <laughs> They say they've come here chasing someone called Krakella, and they're really, really, really tough! Oh dear, oh dear, oh my, oh boy, pardon us, sirs! So sorry! See, our kingdom's priest Priestly was kidnapped by something, or so a recent report of Hoo Hoo Village claim. We have been looking for any sign of the perpetrator. According to the Eyewind Scouts, the Princess, Princess, the Princess Kidnapper wore an odd helmet and spoke of mustard and fake rats. That's all we have to go on. If we come across anything, please let us know. Reopen the investigation. Someone calling us a fink rat. <laughs> I wonder who this guy could be. This is Hoo Hoo Village on the flanks on the flanks of Hoo Hoo Mountain. The mountain is a sacred place. We got everyone should climb Hoo Hoo Mountain once. You can see the whole kingdom from the top. Hmm. Should we be climbing a mountain today? If you climb down this mountain, you reach the town of the Bean Bean Castle. The townsfolk are so much more stylish and fashionable than people in this town. I adore them. So these are cactuses that we're talking to here, which is interesting. I, I saw the prince. I found the kingdom's prince Prince Easy on the edge of the village. I I'm sure of it. He was taken to the top of the mountain by some guy wearing a weird helmet. Hmm. I wonder who that guy is. You two mountains peak. You have to eat. You have to either get a ride from Balladon or hike up. Hiking the mountain is brutal, but if you can get a ride from the Balladon, it's a snap. We can get him. Maybe we can find this Baladon and make our lives easier. No matter how long you wait, Baladon will not come back. I feel it in my bones. You actually have bones? I'm going to question that by myself. Anyway, he saw that someone who looked like Prince Peasley went to the summit and never returned. With Baladon gone, we can't get to the top of the mountain. This ain't good. Alright, let's see. Who you got? Long ago, on this very mountain, the Hooligans... The hoo Hooligans developed the great hoo hoo civilization. At the summit, there still remain many mysteries remnants of the once great people. Huh. Interesting to boot. What do you guys say? The photographs on the walls here are ancient letters known as Hoogriffs. They represent the countless jokes developed by the ancient Hoo Hoo civilization. <laughs> so, this whole place is a laugh? Ha! <laughs> I laugh at you. Don't laugh at us. Oh, I'm sorry. Soldiers came to town. Babylon falls, fails to return, and the bridge suddenly breaks. I have a bad feeling about this. There could be something awful happening on the mountain. Go we'll talk with everyone, folks. You can climb the mountain until the, you can't climb the mountain until the bridge is fixed. The bridge broke, so we were repairing it. Go talk to the villagers for a while and come back. This can this could be real random when these these people actually fix the bridge. This is the home of the Hammerhead Brothers. Right now, they're out looking for rocks they can use to make hammers. I'm sure they'll be back before too long. Hmm. Well, we'll go talk to. Them. Why are you even in their house for the first point? Jeez. So it looks like we have to talk to some hooligans for the time being until uh, they return. Why not? I'm tired of living in the sticks. I want to live someplace cool where there's lots to do. I tell you, living in the city is, does have its perks, but also has its uh, disadvantages too. Have you have you met Sledge and Mallet, the hammer making masters? Oh, so that's what their names are, Sledge and Mallet. And by quality, they are technically look like um, they do really look like um, hammers. If you head left, you can climb down to the mountain's base. Let's go this way. Oh, -ho! there you are, Fawful! <laughs> Get back, Princess Peasley! No! <laughs> hey, you! Ha! <laughs> da! Y you again? You are the pair of feet red that suit with the Bowser I hate. That's us. Yep. <laughs> I say to you, while I was busy with Prince but Peasley, you've been catching me. I have fury. But Kakala has already begun smearing the butter of her next tasty plan over Bean Bean Castle. Since you two can't make it in time, I say to you that it's better never than late. So here's your halting place! Wah! I have fury! 
Since you will not be shattering the stone, I love you trying to climb down this mountain. No! Come back! L Luigi, jump on us! Oh no! Invisible wall! Oh, my main enemy! <laughs> And that's right, there is an invisible wall, we can't jump over there, we clearly could, but we can't. So we're stuck here for the time being until that bridge is fixed. And kind of where's the town, just keep heading back to the left. Well, we could, but something blocked the path. Hey, wouldn't you guys can just uh, stack yourselves up together? That'd be awesome, wouldn't it? I've already talked to you. That looks like a mouth of mouth that we just walked into. You said to descend to the people who developed the hoo-hoo civilization. This land is largely populated by the Beanish peoples, but there are other races like ours. Alright, well, that's good to know, but, uh, we need hammers. <laughs> we need someone to break rocks. We'd have no way of breaking rocks now. Hope those mallet guys find rocks soon. So I'd like to get down the mountain as soon as possible. This way, spin to win. And we've got some boxes here. This is this is obvious. Something's got to be here. Something here now? No. Hmm. Usually stuff like that means that there might be something hidden there. So always check out of the way platforms because you might you might find something there to your liking. There we go. And we got some items. Mushroom. Syrups. Nice. Bunch of coins. Bunch of coins and mushroom. I wish we could make. I wish we could stand here together forever. Ah, the waterfalls must feel so good. My pores are parting. That's something I really shouldn't know, should I? What's in here? Oh, you can't. No matter what you hit me with, <laughs> you can't knock me down. Uh, I think those are big Koopas. We can't do anything with those right now, but we'll have something. We'll learn an ability later on down the game that'll allow us to uh, do this. But uh, we have this little weird thing with Mario. Mario can swallow a lot of water and fluids. And uh, activating certain abilities, uh, Luigi can either shock him, uh, you know, hit him, do whatever he wants, just to get the water out of him in some uh, funny manner. But uh, we'll have to head back. Let's head back down the mountain here. Up the mountain, anyway. Let's see if we can get, you know, see if the Hammer Brothers are back, um, Sledge and Mallet are back. They are still making that bridge. <laughs> this is the last stone! Now we have the true spirit of the Hammerhead Brothers! The stones are last shot! Well, why don't we use the hammers right there? There's two hammers right there hanging! We could use those! <sighs> oof! Oof! This stone isn't gonna do it! We can't make hammers no more! Huh? Mom, what do you two think you're staring at? Ah, uh, hello! Mario and Luigi! Yes! You want us to make you a hammer? Yes! That'd be awesome! Hey, I know you should do this! They're Mario and Luigi from the Mushroom Kingdom! <laughs> the Jumping Hammer Kings! Yeah, you're so right, Sledge! I remember these guys! Why are a couple celebrities like you booming around this place looking for a hammer? But we forgot ours, actually! <laughs> oh, hey, look, you don't have to tell us! We fully understand! Our lips are completely sealed! We'll just make what you need! Professionals, after all! That's right. <laughs> Pros all the way. But the thing is, in order to make hammers, we need hoo-hoo brocks from the mountaintop. And since the Babadons suddenly stopped coming down here, we can't get to the summit. Hoo-hoo blocks are the hard stones. Hammers are made from those things can break anything. We want to climb the mountain to get more hoo-hoo blocks, but we can't jump well high enough to do it. Oh yeah, I was thinking, you guys are jumping pros, aren't you? So are you saying you could jump to the top of the mountain and get us some hoo-hoo blocks? Oh yeah. That would really hook us up. If you get us some hula blocks, we'll make you a special hammer. You scratch our backs, bros, we scratch yours. Sweet. And the bridge is fixed at long last. We're done fixing the bridge. Now it's off to the bridge up there. All right, let's go. Onward to the bridge. We're up to the mountain, I should say. <laughs> Into that one. That was an awkward transition, but whatever. We're now into our first, uh, second area of the game, the Hoo Hoo Mountain. With our basically finding of our basic Goombas of the game, we got beanies. Beanies are basic Goombas in the in the sense as they'll have multiple different forms of themselves. Like uh, they'll have the ability to fly, have spikes, heads on them, all the things stuff. Uh, by killing them, you do get Who Woo Beans. Beans are uh, kind of a unique thing to collect. Uh, who there are four different types of beans. They got Woo, I think, I think Who. I think it's 
Woohoo! Chuckle and Tea Beans. Each bean has are very. Uh, the who? who ah, uh, it's a tongue twister for ever these things, I swear. <laughs> but uh, Woo Beans are going to be the most common bean types being found because they drop by enemies most of the time. The Who Beans are going to be more rare because they are only found in hidden blocks and other and somewhat rare circumstances. Um, chuckle beans are found in the ground. We're not able to gain any of those until we have the ability to get able to dig out of the ground. Until then, we can't get those. Tihi beans are the weird exception to the rule. Tihi beans are very rare, but the fact is they are only available through mini games. Uh, we don't know what the purpose of these beans do yet, but we will soon later on soon what those beans are for. But until then, we'll uh, figure those out later. Right now, we gotta crop. We gotta. We have to trap. We have to tackle a mountaintop. And also, I'm gonna try to attack every enemy because you never know what could be useful. Alright, because we need all the experience points. Booyah! All right, not bad. If it gets to the point where I have to cut out some battles, I will have to do so, but we'll see what happens if it shortens out uh, length time here. Huzzah! We're off! Go. There we go. Jump on that bean. So what are you guys thinking in chat on for comments and time? What do you guys think of Mario and Luigi Superstar Saga? Do you think you guys like this game? Do you think it's actually a really good uh, RPG series? I think so. The fact that they had you know, basically five games to, the, to their name is actually not bad at all. It's too bad Alpha Dream actually went out of business uh, prior to uh, after the re-release of this game specifically. That, that and the Bowser's Inside Story on the 3DS. I hope that, I hope Nintendo can actually use you know use this, uh, the the uh, re you know able to build these games again. Hopefully, see that right there? That's a bean. That's a bean spot for a chuckle bean. But we can't get those because we don't have a way to actually dig the ground yet. We won't be getting that ability for some time, so we're gonna be uh, looking at spots all over the place. Ow! But also we have another enemy. Dry bones makes their appearance. As uh, they're basically a more defensive enemy, but we're strong enough to take them down. No problem, no harm, no foul. Alright, so let's move on forward here. Do, 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 do. What's this? Whirlwind warning, if you have faith in your spins, step into the wind. We have whirlwinds here that actually increase our distance that we can because it spins Mario and Luigi much faster. Make him to fly longer than normal. And these guys are annoying. <laughs> anyway, experience, experience points, is experience. I'll take them out of the wizard. Hoo da! Let's za. Hoo ya! What? You guys have no chance. No chance. Hey ya! Ho oh, ho! I destroyed bones, Mario. Alright, Mario's leveling up to level 6! Uh, let's give some bro points to Mario, because he needs some more here. Cool, 2. Not bad. Again, I'm gonna try to get... I'm gonna try to give power the most priority, though. But Mario usually doesn't gain a lot of BP early on, so we're gonna need that as much as possible. Ooh, boy. Throwing his head like that will attack Luigi, so look uh, for that. Booyah! And Luigi level up to level 6! Alright, let's give uh, power to Luigi, because Luigi is usually weaker than Mario, usually in terms of power, so I want to try to make him even as possible. Booyah! Let's right, jump up this way. Come on, Mario! Looks like we're gonna have to blow some fire out. Boohoo Mountain Watering Hole. We 
come up this way and back around. There's a bean we can't get yet. A chuckle bean, but we're gonna have to come back to that later. Huzzah! Looks like we're gonna have to start some watering holes though, as that is a particular element we're gonna need for this mountaintop. Syrups? Nice, nice. We're gonna need all the syrups we can right now. Beware of overhydration. If, if over drinking systems appear, stop and stop on a victim's head. Spitting excess water on objects in this area is strictly prohibited. So you want so if someone's over drinking like Mario does here, we want <laughs> jump on his head, but also don't extinguish any fires. Oh well. Don't extinguish fires anyway. By extinguishing that fire, we grant ourselves a whirlwind. Not sure how that correlates with everything, but you know, it works out. Let's spin here, let's fly. Come on, yes, made it. Mushroom. Alright, save real quick again. Because we always need to save. You never know what could happen. Because if you do, you would get a game over. The game will revert you back to the last save point you were at. So always uh, promote yourself to do always save your game whenever you can. Ooh. Okay, there's another one of these things here. There we go. Get some more coins. We're going to need some coins if we're going to get some good items. But if our stash stat is anything to go by, we should be getting a discount already by default, so... Let's start out this way with another fight. <laughs> we, have not, we have a lot of fights to go through here. Bean, uh, uh, beanies will try to fake you out if they're going to attack you directly or not, but you can tell exactly when they're going to basically trip on themselves. So take that into consideration for their tell if they're actually going to hit you or not. Booyah! Alright, go here. More fights. Huzzah! Oop, booyah! Take you down, you guys. You guys are have no chance. It's over here. First day. Let's take out the enemies first here because we're gonna, Mario's going to need to be over hydrated in order to actually, you know, complete the attacks over here. I got a lucky. Huzzah! Take that, you dry bones. It is weird there are dry bones on the mountain. I thought Koopas were only a re was only a, a Mushroom Kingdom thing, but apparently Koopas are everywhere. If you know Super Mario World is anything to go by. Huzzah! Oh, booyah! Jump on your head. The guys are going down pretty fast, but they're giving us 16 experience points, which is not bad for this type this point of the game. So we're gonna need some Mar Mar Mario's gonna overhydrate himself. Let's do this bad boy. Do, 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 do. Jump on your head. There we go. It's actually taking the steam from the fire, it actually makes a whirlwind, which is actually kind of a cool combination thing of doing something like that. Uh, if you make Luigi try to drink water, Luigi can't do it. So it's only Mario apparently can Mario can hold his drinks, apparently. So, not sure how Mario can do it, but whatever. Now we can spin ourselves to victory. Ooh yeah! No, ah, fell off. <laughs> Mario, I fell off. <laughs> I gotta take a drink. I am thirsty. <laughs> Jump this way. Back over again. Huzzah! And then spin to victory! Hit this button here. And that actually turns on the water for us. I'm gonna hit this item right here. That's a mushroom. Useful. Jump right that way. Spin to win. Okay, that's nowhere to go. So we can jump down this way. Jump on that dry bones, Luigi. Huzzah! We'll soon be getting new enemies soon, but <laughs> at this point, we're still getting beanies and dry bones. Huzzah! There we go. 
Take you down, guys. Get a lot of woo beans. Not too bad at all. Well, that makes us come back here, because that's our, our fast way out of here. Uh, Luigi, jump on his head. There we go. And that allows us to get another whirlwind for us. Huzzah! Another whirlwind for us. Huzzah! Jump up here. We get a couple of item boxes for our trouble. A one-up mushroom and coins. Because again, there are two. There are multiple different versions of the one-up mushroom. There is the uh, the normal one, which uh, revives you at half health, and there's the super one, which revives you at full health. So now we're at the Hohororos Gate. This is a kid. This could be a game. This could be a game killer for most people because of how this particular spot works. But uh, we're going to have to learn how to spin jump to win. Uh, travelers, I am Hohororos, the ancient weapon of the Hororos civilization. Beyond this point, the path grows even crueler. You must prove yourselves up to the challenge. Dare to try this challenge? Sure! You must start now, and you must catch 10 hoo hoo spirits within 30 seconds. Do not fall off the ledge or you immediately fail. So you have to grab these things in rapid succession. If you fail, we just have to restart. They're now being very kind to us. Oh, now they're not. Now they're being kind. That's nice of them. Come on, baby. Oh, I failed at the last second. Yes. Ugh. Come on. There go faster. This is my only gripe with the game. Well, first gripe with the game is these mini game challenges. Is that you have? There's a lot of them in the game, and they challenge you to do, and they do a lot of very stuff that'll basically say you have to do this, and you have exactly 30 seconds, and they'll actually make, it'll actually take you 30 seconds to actually do it. So now for the next challenge, you must defeat me. All right, boss battle time. We have Uhoros. Uhoros is a very odd character, a very bad boss fight. What we want to do is actually take down these towers first. Take the towers first to, to re release him. But we want to break both of them down because if you do that... Man, Mario... He, he does a lot of damage early on. Go. We're doing a lot more damage to him. We have a lot of mushrooms, so we can use this to our advantage. All right, now we're gonna try to take down the other tower. Oh, should have taken the other tower down. Okay, take you down. Let's see, we have to do that though. See, that's what you have to do. You have to take down the tower he's not occupying in order to actually uh, reveal him perfectly. So we take that down. Mario, take the other tower down. Get him clear of himself, and he's like, oh, nope! Bounce attack on this guy. And now we gotta take down the... Ooh, Mario's gonna die here if I don't do anything. Okay, Mario, take down the tower. Because he's going to try to get around that, and... Come on, Mario. Luigi, jump! Jump to victory! All right! I think that is Luigi's ult uh, move, I believe, that we're referring to here. Uh, he's got the advanced move on. Alright, uh, Mar uh, uh, Mario, take him him. Booyah! He's down already! Booyah! That's very jerkish and it's a very jerkish enemy if you're not powered up correctly. But that's a level up for Mario! 
give a power up to Mario because Mario needs powers. And one again! <laughs> My luck is horrible! <laughs> you have passed the test too? You may not face the test of reaching the summit. Sweet! Now we can move forward. <laughs> 